Yesterday was such a blast. It was great seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my, my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's, uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. Am I on a timer? What? I don't even know, like, what to do. No, don't rewind. Seriously, forgetting how to use this thing. Ooh, let's investigate everything. Damn. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. Oh, Victoria, what the fuck do you want? Uh. Hold on. Max, you busy girl? Avoiding homework as usual. I told you I'd help you out. You never let me help. Okay, drama, stop. And you help me by caring. I do try, by the way. I scored that killer bud from you-know-who. FYI. Save me a bowl. Gotta bounce. Talk to you later. Oh, Come by my room tonight, Max. Are we cool? Just wanted to make sure since you walked away so fast. Nathan was worried, too. If you want to talk, hit me up, K. Love you. Max, if you're mad, just tell me, K. Silence. So if you want to talk, my dorm is open. Love you. Ew. Ew. Why? Oh, God. Look at all these messages. Alyssa. Hey, it's Max. It's a shame that you hang out with those people. I thought you were different. Alyssa, I saw you throw that TP at me. OMG, I was so not aiming at you, I swear. Don't do it again. Oh, we were friends with Alyssa. Taylor? Max, thanks again for talking, taking me to see my mom. I think she wants you for a daughter instead of me. I think not. Your mom is a badass like you. Yeah, right. I cried like a bitch. So did I. You just didn't see me. It's okay to cry. It gets old. My stupid phone is about to die, so call me back. Ew, why do we talk to all these people? Ugh, Nathan, what? Yo, yo, Max, you around in the dark room developing shots for the contest. Sweet. So no two whales for you. Not yet. I'll see you guys later, though. Why do you hang out with these people? Peace out. What about Warren? Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe it's been 18 years since you were brought to us. Maxine, this is your mom. We need to talk about some of your pills. Are you there? Yes, give me some time to answer. I can't just text in every class. Some teacher gets su some what? Some teachers get super pissed when people are use their phone. Yes, because it's super rude and please don't be so sniffy. Sorry. Long day of homework. You're not the only one and that's why we're wondering if you need to spend if you need to spend so much. We want you to have everything you need, but your scholarship doesn't cover everything. You said I could use your credit card when I needed it. I only bought film, not a camera. Maybe it's time to go digital. I'll call you later. I have to go. Don't pout. Love you. Hey, honey, I hope you didn't forget to water the plant we gave you, but don't drown it either, mommy. Seems like Max is a bit of a bitch now. Oh, Max, this is William. If you want to contact Chloe, you can use this number. She would love to hear from you. See you soon. Bye. Hey, Chloe, Maxine here. No, it's been a while. I just wanted to let you know I'm going to Blackwell Academy now. I hope this is still your number. Max is back. Blackwell, that is so awesome. You rule. Best of all, we can hang again. So yes, this is still my number. Cool. I've got a butt load of homework, but we'll get together soon. Don't tease me. It's been too long. I know. I'll see you soon. All right. Um. Oh wait. I think this is the journal. Ah. Uh, sorry, I just dropped something. September 4th, 2013. So much to do. I wish I could slow down time, especially to register all the cool things that have happened since I'm back in Arcadia. Blackwell rules. 
September 21st, yes, I'm older, and thanks to Vic and Nathan, I'm now a bit more fashionable, too. <laughs> they surprised me with the most beautiful straw pork pie hat, wrapped up something something. Best birthday party ever, also drunkest. Great, I can't sleep. October 4th, hey, dear diary, remember me? Busy Max, busy, busy, can't right now. Must shoot, must live, must be friend, should rekindle with Chloe, too, but must vortex first, party time. I have to go upstairs and get Chloe's medicine. Ugh. I don't like Max now. I'm just looking at everything, so don't mind me. What's that? To think that our destiny is linked to goddamn car keys. William! What does the newspaper say? These whales are just a preview of the tornado to come. And the Prescott Foundation? Jesus. Sorry, I was reading. Rachel Amber is even missing in this reality. I guess I can't change everything. Yeah, her family and friends. Leaked all information in case caught interest. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Not She's sure still missing. A third job. They might get their own home taken away because of medical bills. That's terrible. This current account holds the amount of 12,000 payable by August 1st, 2013. This amount has been overdue since March 1st, 2009, and you have ignored multiple requests to make a payment or reckons the, your debt unless the full amount of 12000 is received within 15 days. We must begin the foreclosure process on your home. We have given you more than adequate notice on this issue, and we have no other options left. Are you kidding me? Do you realize that their daughter is fucking paralyzed hey William um, am I bothering you why yes Max I love going through bills <laughs> kidding how can you bother me I haven't seen you in forever I know you look exactly the same <laughs> it's so cool good or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me <laughs> of course you seem more adult now so what's on your mind Let's talk about Chloe. I don't know how to say this, but I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. And she's been a trooper. Is she mad at me? Is she mad at me for not staying in touch? She should be. I have no excuse. She was disappointed, but she knows you care. And I know how hard it is to process all this. It's taken us years. William, I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. Care room? I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high-tech equipment. You should be. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. The insurance helps, but... Uh... I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys, financially. These bills are more like crushing. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. But, but we'll get through it. Price is always right. Get it? No? Hmm. <laughs> Joyce. Being around you and Joyce again is... so... nostalgic. Very old school, as they say. <laughs> I think it's great for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy, too. So, it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay. Or is it? Rachel Amber? I was reading about that missing girl. Rachel Amber? Oh, yes, yeah, she went to Blackwell, right? Oh, poor thing. That's a real nightmare for a family. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her someday. Prescott family? 
The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question. <laughs> Sounds like you know them well. More than I want to. But Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Pan Estates. I don't even like to think about it. So she changed her job. What's going on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. But all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My family. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. <laughs> you act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever you want. <laughs> He's such a sweetheart. Food coupons. Just shoot me now. There's a knife. Oh, so R2 is how you walk faster. What are these? Joyce and William never had a garage sale before. They're drowning in debt just to take care of their daughter. Such bullshit. Please send a check or money order for 3,458. Fuck. Happy credit card. Oh. We regret to inform you that your health insurance no longer covers Chloe's physical rehab. Chloe at a standard rate of oh my fucking god. This is ridiculous. I understand like you have to pay your bills, but in a situation like this, you can't like <laughs> make it any easier on them. Like they're just trying to keep their daughter alive. What what room is this now? Oh, it's empty. Oh yeah, because she couldn't really get up the stairs. So it's just an empty room? I'm not going to do anything with it? A blue butterfly? I'm sure this oh. is a total coincidence. Oh yeah. Oh. I guess we stopped growing up together. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. And I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. I could give Chloe the choice of keeping William alive. And I see that they're a family again. Who am I to judge? Don't know if there's much more she'll say. Letter. I never heard much about William's brother. Oh, he has a brother? Hi, Bill. Sorry for not staying in touch since the accident. Work has been piling up and I'm being sent to Salt Lake City to oversee a new parking lot. You have to go where the work is these days. I wish I could have sent you a bigger check, but you know the story. Money is nobody's favorite thing. Maybe I'll see you next spring for a visit. Kiss Chloe and Joyce from me. Hang in there, Billy. Your brother, Aaron. Shoes. <laughs> Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Let's open it. They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Clearly they never got used. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Dear Joyce, thank you for keeping me updated on Chloe's condition. I can only imagine the struggle you and William are going through. I'm so sorry that I can't help you with a loan at this time. Like everybody else, I'm underwater with my own medical bills. Please give Chloe a hug and my best wishes. Love, Aunt Dorothy. Is there anything else to see in here? I don't think. I don't think, I don't think, I don't think.
don't know what that room is or that. Turn the light switch on. Turn the light on. How the hell am I supposed to see shit? How do you turn the light on? Oh. It's on the inside. Okay. <laughs> uh search. Nothing here. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine too. Why didn't she tell her dad, like, hey, Chloe needs her medicine? The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. <gasps> oh! Oh god, don't yawn. There it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. Well, that's the world we live in nowadays. How's it going, Time Tripper? It's funny. I think I look older. Oh, yeah. What are the photos that I'm supposed to be taking? <laughs> I have to take a picture of a whale. Anything over here? Don't think so. Oh, Max, it is so 